Okay, just wanted to do a quick video as I sit up under here with these uh, last five minutes of red light therapy on my legs. Um, what I wanted to talk about real quick is something called fractional shares, okay? So I've been saying for quite a while that <clears throat> investing is a good thing, okay? But oftentimes what I hear people say when I say it is that I don't have the money to buy, like, I don't know, what's a what's an expensive stock? Okay, so GameStop, for example, right? I think they closed out today around something like 250 bucks a share. Okay, I'm just using that as an example. I know trading with GameStop might be messed up right now. Um, I just got my one share and I can't buy anymore because I'm switching from Robinhood to Webull. And then the reason why I'm not going to be using Webull anymore is because Webull does not sell fractional shares. And that's how I typically invest. I buy ETFs and I just put my little, I can't remember how many ETFs I own, but I'll put like, you know, somewhere between 20 and 50 bucks a week in different ones or whatever depending on how I feel. But anyway, the thing is, what are fractional shares? Where they, they, they sound like exactly what they are, which is fractions of a share. Some brokerages or brokerage apps sell them and some don't. So the thing is, for me anyway, I wanna use a program that sells fractional shares, okay? Robinhood does. But Robinhood is a piece of shit, so I'm not going to mess with them anymore. So what I'm probably going to do, there's a new app I heard about. It's called Public. Um, if you, I'm sure if you search for it, it, whatever app store or whatever that you use, I'm sure you can find it. And if it says Public and something about investing, that's probably it. I, I, I want you guys to do the research on your own. Anyway where the fractional share is. It, it is what it sounds like. It's a fraction of a share. It's a piece, right? So let's say, hypothetically speaking, uh, again, GameStop is maybe 300 bucks. Well, maybe you don't have 300, maybe you have like 150, okay? So if you use a, a broker that does fractional shares, you can literally buy half of a share for 150 bucks or you know, um, maybe you only got 20 bucks. Still, the point is you can put that in there, okay? And you can own a piece of whatever stock it is. And one of my ETFs, uh, ARKK, ARK Innovations, they have Tesla stock in there. I do own like two or three whole shares of that ETF, but I don't think that I own one full share of Tesla, but I own some. So when Tesla goes up, I make some money. Um, yeah, that's it. It's really that simple. So these days, I don't see any reason why you guys should not start investing your money. Hell, like I've said before, there's an app, it's called Acorns. It's great. I love it. That money, once you start, it, what it does is every time you, you link it to your debit card or credit card or whatever, and every time you buy something, it rounds up to the nearest dollar and then takes that money and puts it in like a, basically a pre-programmed uh, investment plan for you. I'm telling you something. That stuff adds up quick, okay? It adds up quick. I can't believe how much money I have in that already. And I've only been using it maybe like six months. Okay. So, hey, look into that. That's a great investment vehicle. All right. That's all I got to say. Peace out. Later.